Calhoun County has a new sheriff tonight. Republican Michael Bryant beat incumbent Glenn Kimbrell, who ran for re-election with no party affiliation. As you can see, Bryant won by a large margin, 68% of the vote to Kimbrell's 32%. News 13's Maggie McGuigan was in Calhoun County tonight. She's live in our studios now. And Maggie, what was Bryant's reaction to tonight's result? Well, he told me he was overwhelmed by the outpouring of support he received, and he's excited to get started. Brian's top priorities are working with school administration for school safety and addressing Calhoun's drug abuse issue. Kimbrell served as Calhoun County Sheriff's for the last 12 years. Brian grew up in Bluntstown and began his law enforcement career in 2001 with the Calhoun County Sheriff's Department. He says his top priorities are addressing the drug issue and working with school administrators regularly to ensure school safety. We have a drug issue in our county and I'm going to prioritize the resources of the Sheriff's Office to title, you know, tackle that first and then just make sure that we divert the resources to the areas that need addressing. Mm. Bryant says he's thankful to the citizens of Calhoun for this opportunity. In the race for the Calhoun County Commission District 1 seat, Republican Ben Hall took on Democrat incumbent Danny Ray Weiss. Hall, who is the Bluntstown Fire Chief, wins by a huge 4-1 to one margin, 82% of the vote to Weiss's 18%. We spoke with Commissioner-elect Hall shortly after the results came in. He says he will keep his role as Fire Chief and Commissioner separate while giving both 100%. I've invested 25 years of my life in District 1 Cowden County and in Cowden County as a whole. Um, it's pretty awesome getting another chance to serve Cowden County in, a, in an additional way, not just a different way, but an additional way. So it's, it's pretty exciting. Uh, what, a, what a race. Uh, I, I got almost 80% of the vote. I want to thank my opponent, Danny Wise. Uh, he ran, we both ran a clean race. Hall says his first priorities are strengthening Calhoun's fire department and emergency services and making roads safer, but not at the expense of the environment. Maggie McGuigan reporting live tonight. Thank you, Maggie.